Our Alicia. Bye-bye. Vince Dooley, the victorious coach, and there's some kind of Georgia Peach Party on Peachtree Street tonight near Athens. Let's go back upstairs. Tim, thank you very much. And now the fire hoses are coming out to try to get the fans off the field. It's a little chilly to be getting drenched down there. But the Georgia fans probably aren't going to mind. They just wanted to go out there and celebrate. I don't think you could ask for more in a football game. Those last two drives, that, I mean, Auburn, that just isn't their style of play. Drive 99 yards, throwing the ball. They came back and almost put it in again. Just a great game. Georgia fans being chased off the field. Some of them don't mind at all. And they're taking the Auburn logo apart at the 50-yard line. They want souvenirs. And the one place the fire hoses aren't being sprayed is at the 50-yard line. Well, you can't blame fans for celebrating, but you don't want to see them tear up the field either. This is one of the prettiest fields in the country. And you can bet the groundskeeper is out there with something sharp trying to get 500 people off the field. He's got his spade out there. I'll tell you, though, that uh, the water's effective, isn't it? Yep. Got a lot of them off. And, of course, these souvenirs aren't going to last long. Dead grass does not make a wonderful souvenir. After a couple of days, it just doesn't do much for you. Our Hartford player of the game tonight in this big upset 20 to 16 Georgia win is sophomore quarterback Wayne Johnson, 6'4, 203, out of Columbus, Georgia, starting his first game in a year and a half. He hit six out of seven passes for 57 yards, one touchdown, and rushed for the other Georgia touchdown of the ball game. 12 points for sophomore quarterback Wayne Johnson. He is our Hartford player of the game. Vince Dooley getting the free ride and one he's probably enjoyed more than any this year as Georgia scores the major upset. We'll be back at Auburn right after this.